Hey guys, in this video, we're going to be showing you how to set the number of decimal places on your financial calculator. So what you're going to want to do is first have your calculator on, click the second button, then go down and click the little decimal place down here. And then that's going to open up this screen here that shows you how many decimal places that you're going to display. You can enter a number between zero and nine since this is a financial calculator. I recommend going probably at least six decimal places uh, so you don't end up over rounding numbers, especially when you're using percentages and things like that. So on this calculator, I have it set to nine. Let's say I want to set it to six. So I type in six. And then after that, I would click enter and then it should be ready to go. So we're going to click clear. And just to do an example, we'll do one divided by three. And you can see that it's currently displaying those six decimal places. So we'll show you one more time here to set that. You click second and then you click the little decimal point down here and then type in how many decimal places you want. So let's say we want to go back to nine click enter and then we're going to clear this out and do one divided by three and you can see now we have nine decimal places showing so that's going to wrap up this video guys thanks for stopping on in we hope to see you in future videos bye